around the back of the hand. He's, he's super talented. I mean, he's he's still getting, he's still improving so much. That's that's incredible. Low for three, right in front. Sinks it. Well, Maudo, he give us some fresh air. He's the, the young, uh, he's the rookie of the team, so he's really learning this season. He has good talent. Might a low three second three pointer. I believe he has something in his blood. Come on, because, you, know, you cannot cheat on DNA. It's no way. It's not your everyday story of basketball success. Modo Lowe has taken a rare path to a professional career in the game. Educated at an Ivy League university in the States, he came to basketball relatively late. He went in a small college, great academics, really great school, but basketball camps came second. I decided to go to the States because you can combine education and basketball in the States very well. Um, in Europe, mostly, uh, you either decide to go professional or um, you decide to study. You can't really combine both. And basketball isn't the end of the story. An artist on court, his creative flair has obvious origins. His mum, Avira Bach, a world-renowned postmodernist artist and sculptor. She's, uh, I would say, internationally pretty known. Um, as she had a painting in the Guggenheim Museum, in the Museum of Modern Art as well in New York. When I was younger, I always asked her, why don't you paint something with basketball? And she always said, I don't know, I don't know. But this season, she, the first time she drew a painting, um, which is basketball related. And I'm, I'm very happy, and it's, it's in my apartment in Bamberg. I guess basketball is it's a very creative sport. There's, there's moments when you have to be very creative. Um, and you know, it's, it's very elegant, it's nice to, to look at. You know, there's, 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 very, there's many elegant parts to the game, so maybe you can make a an association somehow between art and basketball for sure. The way he, he dresses himself and uh, the way the lifestyle he lives, I mean he's, he's very very creative I would say. I, I think he's a very cool guy. He, li he likes to show it too that he's cool, you know. <laughs> I don't know, has, we always say he's, he has a swag, you know, the, just the way he's walking, you know. <laughs> it's been baby steps in the guard's first year as a professional though. His own fiercest critic the German looks to his mother to grow his game. I can look at uh, my mom's career and uh, th there's maybe some parallels, I guess, you know. Uh, she delved into her passion, which is painting and, and art, and she really didn't get distracted by anything else. She just really committed her life to, to, to her art. And I guess that's something that I can also translate to my life because it's the same with basketball. I really, it's my passion, it's my, really what I love to do. He's gonna be great, not even good, great. Just give him time. His time will come because you cannot buy talent at the supermarket.